And we are back with more Siberia, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Anything to see here? Let's see what this do. Does this do anything? Of course not. No. No, no, no. How do I close this menu? Okay. Not there. Jeez, the factory key's big. Apparently her she buys shirts from the same pers same place Guybrush buys pants. A lot of stuff will fit in that shirt apparently. What's on this bench? There's something on the bench? Some kind of newspaper? Let's see what it says. Holy crap, I'm not reading all that. Okay, yes, well, let us pay homage to Anna Vorlberg, who died peacefully yesterday at the age of 86. The great lady devoted her life to her business and our community. This formidable woman had an extraordinary energy, a force that allowed our automaton technology to develop and make our valley continually proud. Her vitality was matched by her generosity and goodness, which has marked all of that... Uh, blah, 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 blah. Valadeline's inhabitants. The mayor of our town has declared today would be a day of collective mourning in honor of Madame Vorlberg. Her funeral will take place this morning at 10 a.m. in the parish church, officiated by the town's own priest. Anna Vorlberg's death marks the end of an era in Valadeline. Va Va I'm never going to say that right. Madame Vorlberg was an outstanding woman who presided over Vorlberg manufacturing for more than 50 years. Her death seems to bring further loss in its wake, sounding the death knell of our automaton factory, the economic heart of our town. It is impossible to view her passing without concern for the future of our valley. In the last decade, computers, video games, and electric robots, electronic robots have become predominant in our consumer society, rendering traditional clockwork mechanisms obsolete. The age of one the wind-up toy is over. Such technology cannot compete in the modern economic climate and has fallen by the wayside. It would have to be definitely consigned to oblivion if Vorlberg Manufacturing had not upheld its renowned savoir faire, helping Valdelaine to... Val... Valadeline to remain economically, economically active. However, today the industry has lost its spiritual force. The future looks bleak. Maybe the time has come to celebrate the prospective American takeover of the company, but what will be the cost to the soul of Valadeline? Ecology. The protest group Mountain Peace demonstrated yesterday in the site of the new Espiat Dam. They claim the construction of the dam has damaged the blue warbler's natural habitat. Intervention on the part of the forest ranger was necessary to disperse the demonstration. Okay. Can we go in here? No need to go down there. Okay. Is there a need to go over here? It's just going to say no need to go there. I just know it. Where's this lead? Hey, it's open. Or not. Kind of figured it wouldn't be. Should have known. I don't think I can go any further this way. Huh. All right. Let's explore the other end of town. Hi, Baker. Relentlessly, relentlessly self-improving boulangerie owner from Belgium. There we go. Whoa! Phone call. Phone call. Phone call. Hello. Kate. Kate. Dan, I'm so pleased to hear your voice. Hey, he's in our phone. How are I mean, you? He's stored Did you in our have phone. a good journey? Ah, have you settled husband in? Husband or boyfriend? Ah, it was long, tiring, damp, especially. But I'm okay. Especially when you... Everything going as planned? Yeah, I mean, well, not really. It's not exactly what I thought it would be. You know, everything's so different here. Actually, while we're on the subject, I managed to free myself up from our lunchtime. I'll come and meet you at the airport. I hope the flight from Paris won't be delayed. We're expected at the Goldbergs about 8 o'clock. I hope you have the time to take a shower and change, my poor honey bun. Dan, I don't think the Goldbergs tomorrow night is really on. Don't worry, Kate. You'll be as perfect as ever. 
Anyway, you never have to wear much to look really great. Dan, Dan, I I'm going to have to extend my stay here. There's one or two complications. You understand? Kate, honey, what are you talking about? It's only a measly toy factory. The sale isn't going through as expected. I I've got to stay a bit longer. Dan, you don't mind, do you? But Kate, Katie, you can't do this to me. I mean, it's the Goldberg contract. There's millions of dollars on the line here. Well, whoop de do. I'm sorry. You go ahead. Don't worry about me. I'll get back as soon as I can. I promise. Okay, I I I've got to go. I'll call you back soon. Love you, honey. Okay. That accomplished nothing. At least I know the plot's developing. New things don't happen unless the plot is developing. Can I go in here? Oh, that's the hotel. I don't want to go in here. Bridge? I hate it when perspective changes. Ooh, a church. Hello, church. And the gate is wide open for once. Another call? Hello. Kate, so what's oh, new? this guy, our boss. We've got a problem, Mr. Marson. And it's not my what fault. problem? Come on, Kate, don't beat around the bush. There's maybe an heir. There's air. maybe? What? Hans, Anna Varlberg's brother. Uh, looks like he's still alive. We can't buy the factory without his consent. What? What is this? Where's this mystery brother come from? And more to the point, where is he? What did the notary say? Nothing. I mean, nothing else. You know, sir, it's an odd town here. Everything's odd. The people, things... The situation's not straightforward. I have a small bit of research to do. Listen to me, Kate. Universal Toys is one of our biggest clients, and I don't care how weird that town is. All that matters is that you do not set foot back in New York before you've tied up the deal. Get the picture. Yeah, you're a jerk. That's yes, the picture. Yes, Mr. Marson. You can count on me. I... He hung up. Darn Prick. it. Prick. Jeez, what a prick. I can't remember if I said this is brought to you by GameAnyone.com or not in this video yet. I'm terrible about that. Oh, come on! No point. It's locked. Jeez. The church is locked. How's God get in? Seriously. Doesn't look like that works. Some kind of freaky elevator. Hey, I remember this. You remember that? can't place these in the wrong place. What kind of puzzle is this? So, Momo knows how to get up here apparently. He stole the gears. Elevator go up. And your elevator is my elevator. You don't push the button, I push the button. Whoa, mannequin parts. Creepy. Creepy mannequin parts. What's this thing? What's that thing? What's this do? What's that do? What's this? What are these things? There's a bird's nest. And a bird. What's all this? Can I even look at it? No? How do I do this? What do I do? <laughs> Excuse me. Hiccup.
I don't think I can do anything up here yet. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and check the time, because I'm not very good at judging and I keep forgetting to, you know, set any kind of timer. I'm gonna go ahead and call it here. Or it's only been ten minutes and I've been jump over jumpy about running along. That's possible, too. Is this a dead end? It's a dead end. And dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end, dead end. That's a crypt. Maybe I didn't explore all the way over here? I don't know. Run, run, run. Wait a minute, there's more down here and I didn't notice it. A door! What are the chances it'll be open? I would say about one in... Well, so far, one in... Not only... Only a percentage of the doors have been openable. Oh, you're kidding me! Awesome! What's this? What's that? What's this? What are these things? I want to look at these things. What's going on here? Cabinet? Pictures? I can't open it. Oh, this thing's jammed. Oh, wait. There's... I need a key. I need a key. Alright, fine. I'll find a key. Nothing there. Nothing there. No. Oop. Dude, I know these people like their automatons, but seriously, an automaton Jesus on the cross is a bit, bit much. Ooh, there's a thing. This thing's jammed. Oh, still didn't work. Oh, this thing's jammed. I know, I know. Close drawer. Uh huh. To my to my successor, the Vadeline Va Va Valadeline Parish Priest. The sanctity of confession is a sacred vow, so these revelations are the result of much soul-searching and reflection. Oh, I don't have time to read this right now. I'll read it at the start of the next video. Punch cards. So many punch this cards. This thing's jammed. I don't think any of the other drawers have false backs. Awesome. All right. We're exploring the church. Alright, now I think we're either out of time or close enough that it doesn't matter. Of course. No point. It's locked. Bite me. Alright. This should be closer to out of time. This time I'll see you soon. Good night, everybody! Today we have learned I really suck at timing. Alright, I have one minute left to kill. More or less. I just don't want to end it at 13 minutes something. I got some punch cards, and if I remember correctly, those can be useful up here. Do we really need to see the elevator go up again? Seriously? Really seriously? Alright, let's start putting the punch cards into this thing, which I happen to know runs on them. There we go.
Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. Let's try the blue one. Wedding march? Fascinating. 